Dear students, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I am Anzur Ahmad Ganai, lecturer of history. Our today's topic for 11th class students of history subject is What were the effects of the Crusades on Europe and Asia? Dear students, we were trying to know about the effects of Crusades on Europe and Asia. Let's try to understand what Crusades mean. Crusades were the wars started by the European Christians against the Muslims to conquer and liberate the holy land of Jerusalem in Palestine and other areas like Syria, Lebanon, Palestine, Israel, Jordan from the occupation of Muslims. But the focus was on the holy land of Jerusalem. Their students, Jerusalem, or also known as Jerusalem, was conquered by Muslims in 638. Since then, it was under the control of Arab Muslims. But this Jerusalem was important for Christians because, according to Christians, Jerusalem was the place where Jesus Christ, their prophet, was crucified, means hanged, and resurrected, means he came back to life after death. So, this Jerusalem was very important religious place for the Christians. Therefore, they wanted to get control of this Jerusalem in Palestine at any cost from Muslims. And with the purpose to get control of or reoccupy or reconquer this Jerusalem from Muslims and other such areas which I earlier mentioned it, like Syria, Lebanon, Palestine, Israel, Jordan, etc. The, these with the purpose to conquer the Jerusalem especially and other, other such areas, the Christians, European Christians started wars and these wars came to be known as Crusades. And there were in total eight crusades which are fought between Muslims and, Muslims and Christians from 1096 AD to 1272 AD. However, at the end of these eight crusades, Christians were not able to get control over the holy land of Jerusalem. And these crusades had far reaching effects on Europe and Asia which can be discussed as under. Number one, one of the most significant effects of Crusades was the long-term religious hostility between Christians and Muslims. After these Crusades, the Muslims in any part of the world looked at Christians as their enemies and Christians looked at Muslims as their enemies. And hostilities and animosities brew, a bit, brew up between the two communities. And these hostilities and animosity between Christianity and Muslims, which erupted because of Crusades, is continuing even now in the modern world. Number one. Number two. It was due to the Crusades that the institution of feudalism was given a death blow and the kings got their power back. Dear students, feudalism is a vast huge concept. In nutshell, we can here say it was a system in Europe, in medieval Europe, where the landlords used to occupy huge tracts of land, huge land estates and control that. And on the basis of these land estates, these, land tra these huge tracts of land, they used to control the king and other systems of the European, uh, this uh, of Europe. So what we need to understand, these feudal lords, these feudal lords who had these huge lands under their control, who had a lot of power with them, what they did, they used to give lands and a number of uh, finances to support the crusades. As a result, these crusades were, in, were not ending, at least eight crusades took place and the feudal lords went on financing these, these uh, 
uh, expeditions or financing these wars, these crusades. With the passage of time, these crusades resulted in the weakening the power of the, power of the feudal lords because feudal lords continuously used to finance the crusades with their with their lands and with their money. As a result, their power, their power and their their wealth got declined, and the kings who used to work under the pressure of feudal lords once again got their power back because now feudal lords lost their power as they lost money to by financing this this uh, money and land by financing crusades. So kings got back their power and feudalism went into back foot. Number two. Number three. The crusades added to the prestige of the Pope and Pope played an important role in the European politics for next two centuries. Who was Pope? Pope was basically a head of Roman Catholic Church, considered the worldly leader of Catholic Church. Their students, why the popularity of this Pope increased? Their students, it was Pope who used to organize and collect finances and money from different organizations, from, from different Christian organizations and countries to finance the Crusades. So, the, so the orders of Pope, the, the, support, the supporters of Pope and the prestige of Pope increased as it was the Pope who used to finance and start and organize all the Crusades. So the, so the wealth of Pope increased and the prestige and respect of Pope increased in the European history. Another important point, dear students, due to Crusades, trade and transportation also improved in Europe. How? Because dear students, the Crusades combined different European countries with one another with the pur purpose to fight Crusades against the Muslims jointly. As the European countries got to different European, European countries got together, European Christian countries got together to fight crusades, this concept of togetherness gave rise to transportation and trade between these European countries. So trade and, trade and transportation also increased or improved with the help of these crusades. Another important effect of crusades was the crusades led to change in the methods of warfare. Massive forts were constructed for defensive purposes. New kinds of weapons and gunpowder was discovered. So, never and never techniques of war and weapons were discovered or invented by both Christians and Muslims to defeat one another. Increase. Number next, the Crusades resulted in an increase in the knowledge of the Europeans. The European Christians were astonished to see the progress made by Muslims in the field of architecture, science and technology and try to imbibe or imitate from this science and technology and learn, um, learn it and uh, implement it in, in, in their own systems and politics. Thank you.